Hey guys, welcome back to The Bright Side. Macy here, The Bright Side Girl, and today we're gonna to be doing a Christmas decor haul. I got extra fancy for you guys today. No, my shelves are still not all the way done, but we gotta start getting some holiday content out there. As you may know from my recent decor haul videos, I love to decorate for the holidays, especially Christmas. I think I've actually reached the point though where I have more Halloween than I do Christmas. This is because I've gotten rid of a lot of Christmas stuff over the years that I had for like a really long time. When I was younger, I kind of collected literally anything that like people didn't want, and I didn't really care if it like had a theme or anything like that. I just wanted anything because I didn't have anything. So now as I'm an adult, I've been slowly kind of picking themes and styles and getting rid of some things that don't match that anymore. I don't go as crazy buying decor and things at Christmas time as I do Halloween, mainly because I also have to buy Christmas presents and do holiday activities. And so I try to spend most of my Christmas budget for that. But I did get a few things. We'll probably do two more hauls after this. This is a lot smaller than my Halloween haul. I will have another Disney themed Christmas haul. And then if I find enough other things that I like, then I will haul that as well. So we're just going to talk about some things. I'll list the stores that I got them right here for you guys. Some of this stuff's hard to find, so you may not be able to see it in stores. I get a lot of things from Home Goods and TJ Maxx, and they have a high rotation, so things are always changing. But we're just going to dive right in. Almost my favorite thing I've gotten so far. At At Home, I got this gingerbread house. Oh my gosh, it is so amazing. It lights up. You can't really tell because it's not dark out, but it has so much detail. And what I really liked about this house is that it is like one solid piece. It's not made of clay. Let me show you an example here. So I have things like this that are actually made of like polymer clay and then like baked and put together. And I like them, but I feel like they're not quite as dirty. Things can kind of fall off more. So I try to keep the houses, and I'm going to get one house every year, unless I can find smaller ones that are cheaper. I got two houses last year. This one was expensive. It was like $39, but for the size, it wasn't a bad price. And I have not seen anything else this cool out and about yet that's not clay. So, so excited to put this in the living room. I think that's the only thing that I got at At Home and I went like early in the season. They have really, really good stuff. So at TJ Maxx, I got this Christmas tree mug. Last year I really wanted a Christmas tree mug and I couldn't find one because I waited too long. And I saw this one and I so liked it. I actually got this first at Home Goods for $9.99 and then I found it at TJ Maxx for $7.99. So I returned the other one because you gotta stretch the budget. So keep an eye out at TJ Maxx and Marshalls. They have a pink version as well that's beautiful. Um, it's just got a little topper here. I thought it was really fun. This is by Mr. Christmas is the brand. <laughs> Okay, next up at Target, I didn't get a ton of things yet because I haven't just seen a ton that I liked, but at the Bullseye Playground, I got these little glass trees. They're like red and green. And these were a dollar. They're really cute. And I mainly got them because I don't have a lot of knick-knacky things to like put on the bookshelf. So I thought this was a cheap way to get a couple things and they're really, really, really pretty. And then for $3, I got this little Nutcracker guy. Uh, this was a little pricey for what it was, but I really like Nutcrackers and I liked that this was ceramic and again would be really cute for the shelves. And they had white and green as well. So if you have the Target app, every time you purchase something, you get like, I think 2% back or something on the app. It's not a credit card or anything. And I like to kind of save that along with they do a lot of deals a couple times a month where it'll be like buy $20 in beauty products and get a $5 gift card. And so I kind of keep an eye out and if there's stuff that I need, I'll use those. And I save my like Target earnings for silly stuff like this. So I got these two pairs of earrings from Target. They're Sugar Fix by Bobble Bar. Bobble Bar earrings are very expensive. Um, normally they're like $50, but they make a brand version of them for Target that I think are just as cute. And these were both 13. So these are little eggnog earrings, which I love. And then just little coffee cup latte looking Christmas earrings. Okay, then at Burlington, I think I got this at Burlington, I, I got a couple things. So I got this latte soap dispenser. I have a fall version of this that I keep in my kitchen. I thought this would be really cute for over my sink. So it just looks like a little latte or a little cup of cocoa. And it's for... It's dish soap or bathroom soap, obviously. And this was $8.99. I also got something kind of random. They had this beautiful, like, faux fur red plush jacket 
for 22 and I don't know why I just had to have it it's not very heavy which is good because it gets like chilly ish here but it rarely gets below like 50 unless it's nighttime like really late at night so you need something like a little bit lighter but I thought for like over my holiday outfits and things and even like into Valentine's Day I love it. 20 bucks, Burlington. Okay, I cannot believe I didn't talk about this in my Halloween hauls, but my friend Brittany introduced me to these Onyx Sugar Scrub brand for Halloween. And I got this like wicked apple one and it's so awesome. So I fell in love with the scrub and I used an entire thing over like six weeks. So I went ahead and looked for the Christmas one. So Marshall's had these. This is Don't Wake Me Until December 25th. This is a gingerbread one. These smell so good and they foam and they leave you feeling really soft. And just like the texture of them is very cool. I don't even know how to describe it, but they're just so much fun. You just literally want to keep like putting your scrub on. <laughs> so I got that gingerbread one. I got this Santa I Know Him one which is a sugar cookie and it's like red and then sugar cookie and they just have such a fun texture. And then I got this Believe in Your Elf which is a peppermint one. These are normally $5.99 individually. These two came together in like a little Christmas set for I think $10.99 so it was a little cheaper that way. I am obsessed with them. I love them so much. Again at Marshall's I found this like whipped I don't know, it almost looks like a sundae with like whipped cream on it, but it's got a star, so it's like a tree, but a sundae thing. Again, goes good with my theme. And this was $12.99. Okay, then I think this is the only thing that I've gotten at Dollar Tree so far. I haven't really liked a lot of their stuff. It's a little bit too cheap. I actually got these last year, but I think they're coming back. So they had these little gingerbread houses. This is like a little gingerbread like plaque house, but this is a full house where they almost look like they're waffles. I thought these were really cute again to like set on my bookshelves and I also have like a gingerbread Candyland theme in the living room. Got these two. I think they're supposed to be fairy houses. I got two things at Walmart. So I got two ornaments. Again, I have like a little latte cocoa theme. So this is just a little ornament, but again, I like to use them as shelf decor or like tiered tray decor, kitchen decor, and then this little gingerbread cookie man this will go good for my tree. And I don't have a ton of ornaments for the theme that I have. And these were both $2.48. Then I actually got the majority of my stuff at Ross this year. They were getting stuff from Michael's last year, which is very cool and just marking it really good. So I got these sugar cookie ornaments. They're pastel color, which I don't love, but I just love the, the cookies. And you can also use them just to like set out on a plate in the kitchen to look like little cookies. Here's a little Christmas tree. Really cute. And they also go good if you make like gift baskets and things just to like stick an ornament in there. And then I also got this bowl of these little like almost ballet looking Santas decorating with Christmas lights. This is Spectrum Designs, which is the brand that I use the most in the kitchen. It's nice quality stoneware. It doesn't chip easy. It doesn't get overly hot and dishwasher microwave safe. <laughs> this is a larger bowl, like just for like popcorn or salads. I got two of them because I don't actually have a lot of bowls to match my Christmas dishes. So I love, it's so cute. And then I got this little reindeer. This is from Michael's last year, but I got it Ross for $4.99. I think there were 17 at Michael's. So cute. I have a little one. I don't normally do like stuffed things like this, but I just really liked her. I'm trying to find another one because I want to give it to my mother-in-law for Christmas because I feel like she'd really like it. So fun. I just went to Trader Joe's yesterday early November and they put out their 12 days of beauty. This is a beauty advent calendar from Trader Joe's and it just has like body butter and makeup remover and they're really small samples and this is $19.99 but it was like my favorite thing last year and I preferred this over getting like a candy one because we're already eating like more sweets and things than normal this time of year. And it was just really fun to open for the first 12 days of December or 12 days leading up to Christmas. Then at Home Goods, I found this gingerbread Christmas tree. I'm not entirely sure where I'm putting it yet. It didn't fit in the spot that I wanted, <laughs> but again, I have a little gingerbread theme. This was $9.99. I thought it was so cute. It was so cute that actually someone else in line like stopped and went to go find one. <laughs> I got a few things at Hobby Lobby. Christmas is 50% off. I think it's actually 60% off now, but I got these for 50. So I got this little s'more ornament. So cute. Jeff loves s'mores. So I thought this would go good in our festive tree and this was five so I got it for two and then I got these like candy stick ornaments that were four so I got them for two a piece again I'm going to put these probably like in a vase or something if I don't put them on the tree and just have them like on display really like them and then I got another cookie gingerbread ornament and this one was 
four, so I got it for two. Okay, then at the 99 cent store, I got this plaid table runner. I actually got three or four of these to kind of put all over my house, <laughs> and this was $3.99 really good price for a table runner. I use these on my desk and like my bookshelves and things. So pretty plaid. They also had these icing cookie decorations that were like gingerbread and all of this kind of stuff. They're so cute. These are to like put on top of like cupcakes and cake and stuff so you don't have to make your own. This was a dollar by the way, but I actually have been using them to like put on our hot cocoa and I'll probably use them in like photos and stuff. I'll probably do several things with these, but they're so cute, really cute with like whipped cream and then a little like gingerbread guy in your cocoa. Then I got some of their sprinkles. These are just such a good deal for sprinkles. And I like to use sprinkles for decor as well. So just all kinds of things. And then I just got one of their little snowy trees that are a dollar just to kind of put around the house. Okay, hey guys, I just filmed part two of this haul. It's been a couple days. A Disney edition, so stay tuned for that. But I have some other things that are non-Disney related that I've gotten since I filmed this video. So I thought I'd pop in and show you guys here real quick. So I got some holiday scrunchies at TJ Maxx and some non-holiday ones too. These are kind of like New Year's y to me. They're just so much nicer on your hair. I'm so glad scrunchies are back and I've loved my Halloween ones. So I got these like really pretty shiny ones. These were $5.99 and these were $4.99. This was a, a better deal, but these were more festive. Actually, I think I got these at Marshall's. Then at Home Goods for five, I got these little Santa ramekins and these are dishwasher, microwave, oven safe. So you can blow torch with them and make like creme brulee or other souffles and things. So cute, I love them. And you can also use them to, like hold your rings or other trinkety items. And then I got this snowflake silicone mold because I use these for everything. Soap, bath bombs, presents, all kinds of stuff. And this was, I think $3.99 at TJ Maxx. And then my favorite dishware companies designed for their Christmas dishes this year. I can't buy them all because I already have Christmas dishes, but I did get this mug. So it's a hummingbird with a Santa hat and a candy cane. I love hummingbirds so much. We have a lot of them here in California. He's on like a holly branch. It's so precious. So I love these mugs. They're dishwasher microwave safe. They're Eli and Anna, which is very similar to the Spectrum ones that I have and they kind of match my other dishes because they've got like speckling and things and I did get two of the plates in the same design. These actually match my regular dishes kind of better. Now I have eight plates for Christmas which is always good having a backup. Okay now back to the regular video. Then lastly and my favorite thing <laughs> like you're not even gonna be able to see it. Hopefully it's not too out of focus but it's just this big snowy wintry photo. So we have a big area in our living room that I don't have any art for. So this will be my first piece of art for it. I think this was like 30 or $35 at Burlington and it is absolutely freaking huge. Such a good price. So I'm very excited to hang this up. Um, Jeff's actually going to hang it up for me tonight because we're almost done decorating. Yay. Okay. So that is it that I've got for now. I got a decent amount. I'll be getting a few more things here and there. I like to get things that are like really special when I see them. I will be having a Disney Christmas haul soon because I'm going to be going to Disney soon and I have some other Disney themed things. So stay tuned for that. Stay tuned for more festive holiday content. Don't forget to join in on Jingle Bellathon, which starts November 28th. All the information will be linked down below. I will have a Christmas themed book haul and all that jazz. So stay tuned and I'll see you guys next time on the bright side.